Hi everyone, this is Miss Post here. This is our first ukulele tutorial. This video is mainly just um, a refresher for all the fundamentals, knowing the ukulele parts, as well as getting familiar with the strings and our strumming pattern that we've covered in class so far. So we have our ukulele head, which has the four tuning pegs. Um, which you will need to tune. Normally when you walk into music class, it's already tuned for you. So if you don't have a tuner at home, you're also able to download a tuning app that um, can be put on an iPhone, on any device really. And there are some great ones out there that are for free, so you just need permission to download one. So like I said, we have our ukulele head, our four tuning pegs. We have our neck, our ukulele neck, which contains the four strings. Uh, it contains our frets, which are the spaces in between all these fret wires right here. And then we have our fret markers down here. So a lot of the, uh, the part that we're that I'll probably be referencing to a lot is the body, and which is this part right here. Then we have our sound hole, our saddle, and our bridge. So our rest position, just like we do in class, is you're holding the ukulele on your left hand, putting it on the left knee. So that's the position that you play, that you stay in while we're waiting um, for directions. You're waiting um, just to, even if you're just following along in the video. When you're ready to play, you're going to put the head of the ukulele onto your left shoulder, and that hand is still holding onto the neck. Your right hand is going to go over your ukulele. And then you're going to be strumming your ukulele with your thumb slightly above the sound hole. Okay, so again, you go from rest position onto your playing position. Okay, and like I say in class, our, the body of the ukulele is going to go up against your stomach. That way it is nice and secure and you're at a good posture. Remember, we want happy ukuleles, not hyper ukuleles or sad ukuleles. So just plain old happy ukuleles on your tummy, okay? So here we have um, our four strings. So normally we're starting from our the string that's closest to our nose to the string going to our toes. So we have D, C, D, A. So a quick uh, way to remember your notes are green, cats, eat, ants. So just like we have shortcuts to remember the music staff, we also have a shortcut to remember our four ukulele strings. So we have green, cats, eat, ants. So before you start actually strumming, we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna play our, our, our green, our G. We're gonna play that four times. So using, um, keeping a nice and steady beat and playing four chord notes on our G, okay? So you're gonna go D, now you try playing it four times. Ready? Here we go. D, 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 D. Now you're gonna. If you need to look down, just um, just to get your finger in the right place. Our next string is going to be C. So C sounds like this. All right. So now you're gonna play it four times, making sure that you keep a steady beat. I'll play it with you. One, two. Here we go. We've played G, we've played C, and now we are moving to our E string. So again, we're going to play four steady quarter notes, okay? So just watch me. You're going to play E, E, E. All right, so now you're going to play with me. Ready? One, two, here we go. E, E, E. Okay, so... Our last string is our A string. The A string is the string that is closest to your toes. All right, so we've done G, C, E, and A. So my turn, then your turn. A, 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 A. So now try it with me. Four steady quarter notes, here we go. A, 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 A. And now since we're done playing, you're gonna go back to your rest position. So our next thing that we're going to try is our strumming. So like I said at the very beginning, you're going to be strumming using your thumb. And for right now, we're only going to strum going down. So
So as you're at home working on this, you want to make sure that you're strumming all four strings um, as you're playing the chords or if you're just um, getting used to the ukulele. Especially for my um, fifth grade classes that just started playing ukulele, please take your time doing this. And it's also good practice if you try it in front of a mirror. That way you can see what your fingers are doing without building the bad habit of looking down at your ukulele constantly. So here we go. From rest position, you're going to go onto your plank position. Put your arm over the ukulele. And all I want you to do is strum four times. So we're going to do my turn, then your turn. Okay? So down, 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 down. So you're going to try it with me, making sure that you get each and every string ready. Here we go. Down, 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 down. So I want you to, um, you can pause this video and practice that a couple of times. Um, you can even have mom, dad, siblings, anyone that's around you, um, just kind of be your partner and check on that you're strumming each and every string. So now we're going to try our new pattern that we're going to be seeing um, here in the first beginning pieces that we're going to be learning. So this one's a little bit harder. So take your time, pause it, practice this as much as you need to, okay? It's going to go down, 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 up, down. And again, you want to make sure you're getting all those strings on your way down and up. So I'm going to play a couple more times for you just so that you get the rhythm of it, and all it is is ta, 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 ti, ta, so ta, 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 di, ta, so down, 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 up, down, okay, I'm going to play it one more time, down, 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 up, down, and it helps if you say the strumming pattern, so as you're playing, say down, 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 up, down, so so pause this if you need to, all right? And then we'll try it together. Ready? Here we go. Down, 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 up, down. Okay, so now we're going to combine our four strums going down with our strums going down, 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 up, down. So this is what it's going to sound like. Ready? So just listen. Down, 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 down. So I'll do it one more time for you, okay? It's down, 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 up, down. So in total, you're playing eight beats worth of music. You're going down, 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 up, down. All right, so try that. And that'll conclude our fundamentals just for this part, okay? See you guys in the next video.